Hello. Welcome to my channel. Topic to be studied today is Typhoid Fever. In this video we will cover. What is Typhoid? Its causes. Mode of transmission. Signs and symptoms. Complications. Diagnosis. Prevention from Typhoid. And at last its treatment. Typhoid Fever. It is also called as Enteric Fever. It infects the small intestine. Typhoid is a highly contagious disease. It transmits from person to person. It mostly affects the children. And more common in Asia and Africa. Typhoid fever is a bacterial disease, which is caused due to bacteria named Salmonella typhi. Mode for transmission of typhoid fever is fecal, oral route. It spreads through food and water, contaminated with the feces of infected person via unhygienic hands. Best example to understand this is Typhoid Mary. Mary Mullo commonly known as Typhoid Mary. Cook who infected between 51 and 122 people with typhoid fever in USA. She was identified as asymptomatic carrier of Salmonella typhi. It can also be transmitted by drinking raw or unpasteurized milk. So we should always eat healthy food. Moving on the signs and symptoms. Symptoms of typhoid appears after 10 to 14 days of incubation. High fever. Headache. Fever with chill. Stomach pain. Diarrhea or constipation. Rashes. Complications due to typhoid fever are. Severe stomach pain. Abdominal cramps. Sepsis. Bleeding inside stomach and ulcers. Damage to internal organs. Lab investigations to identify typhoid are. Most common test is Weidel test. But its findings are not so accurate. Blood culture test. IgM test. Stool examination. Preventions from getting infected are. Maintain hygiene by washing hands with soap properly after coming from washroom. Proper sanitization of toilets, sievers, and neighborhood. Drinking well pasteurized milk. Eat healthy food. Avoid roadside food. Let's move to the last and the main topic of this video. That is treatment of typhoid. First is vaccination. Vaccination is given by two routes, injectable and oral. Injectable form consists of an inactivated typhoid vaccine, while oral form consists of live typhoid vaccine. Booster dose is required after every two years in injectable form, while in oral vaccine four doses a week are given. Next and the best way to treat typhoid is bed rest and soft diet. Antibiotics such as ciprofloxacin or cefixine or ofloxacin can be used in treatment of typhoid. Their dose depends upon the weight of patient. Proper treatment should be given, depending upon the symptoms of patient. For fever, paracetamol should be given. For gastric acidity, ranitidine or pantoprazole should be given. For nausea, ondensetron should be given. Their dose depend upon the weight of the patient. Hope you guys like this video. I request you to press the like button and please subscribe to my channel. Doctor this side and press the bell icon to get notified for the upcoming video.